Hello, everyone, and I hope you had a splendid week. So for this week, we are going to cover the following. We are going to start with the final unit. I'm sure you're all excited that the year is coming to an end. I'm very happy with your progress in general. Keep it up and show me what you've got in the final unit. Okay, so we're going to start off the unit, obviously, by introducing the concepts and context. And I want you to try to create your own SOI statement after understanding what the concepts and context are. Then we're going to move on and start defining and identifying the main idea of this unit. We're going to review what is meant by consumerism. So from its word, yeah. consumer and ism, okay? So consume, we are consumers and we consume, we consume things in large quantities, okay? And this could impact the environment. You need to ask yourself, how could this impact the environment? And why could it impact the environment? Then we're going to move on to the psycho psychology part. If you watched my main video for the unit, you'll know what I mean by this part. Maslow's hierarchy of needs. So Maslow is a, is, a, is a philosopher, and he came up with a diagram that, look, that is a hierarchy, and it discusses essential levels that are all interdependent and cannot stand by themselves. So we, sta we started off with these physiological needs, and then we moved to safety needs, beloved and belonging or belongingness and love needs, then esteem. And finally, we reach the highest level of the hierarchy known as self-actualization, which means reaching your highest potential. We're going to take this diagram and try to look at it. How does mass, our school, modern American school, reflect Maslow's hierarchy of needs towards the students and their teachers? So we're going to think about it. Can we apply this in our real life? That's a question I want you to think about while watching this video and come up with the answer when we meet on Sunday.